I'm Todd Mattis, General Manager of Automated Wire Products. Even though they are physically separate processes, AWG considers all manufacturing operations to be part of a continuous flow. This means for a ground compression spring, we do not coil the springs without the part set up in the grinder and ready to produce springs that meet our customer print requirements as well as conform to the AWP visual workmanship standard. In this arrangement is the use of sorting chutes on our Simplex Rapid Coilers. Every spring recoil is made to a free length tolerance. Even if the free length is a reference on the print, we use the free length pits to control the spring forces. Assuming the spring diameter is consistent, the longer a spring is, the stronger the forces are, and the shorter a spring is, the weaker the forces are. Our standard process is to sort two ways. Based on the tolerances for the spring forces, we calculate the appropriate free leg tolerance that will produce springs with a consistent amount of grind along with meeting the print requirements. Prior to the spring being cut off on the coiler, a camera reads the free length of every spring and the parts that measure within the free leg tolerance band go through the sorting chute and enter the stress relief oven. The springs that are either too long or too short are directed to the side by a flapper in the sorting chute. These long and short parts are considered scrap, which we send to a metal recycler. The amount of spring scrapped is dependent on the tolerances of the spring forces on the customer print. For parts with very tight spring force tolerances, or part configurations that result in a high scrap rate, we initiate five-way sorting. We are able to slightly expand the acceptable free length tolerance band and then split it into three groups. The slightly short and slightly long springs enter separate stress relief ovens just like the springs in the center of the free length tolerance band. By separating these three groups and making grinding adjustments accordingly, we are able to reduce coiling scrap compared to if we just use the standard two-way sorting on these tighter tolerance springs. Once again, the longs and the shorts are scrapped and sent to recycling. Sorting chutes are an integrated part of our coiling process that we fully maximize to produce world-class compression springs. That's the AWP way.